Hello, my, my name is Stephen Herring. I, I grew up in uh, Jacksonville and went to church uh, all my life ever since I can remember. Um, and I grew up and I, I, I did the things that I was supposed to do, but I didn't really know why. And uh, eventually I, I turned 18, graduated high school, went to uh, the Air Force, and in my time in the Air Force, I, I began to uh, not go to church. I stepped away, I just, uh, I just backslid is what it was. Uh, from everything that I had grown up knowing and I found many times that I would do the things that I had always promised myself that I would never do and it got me to a point where I was hating who I was becoming um, I had become very narcissistic very arrogant um, as a cover for my own uh, issues knowing that I was doing wrong knowing that I was raised better and yet I couldn't do anything about it. And finally it came to a head when I was about uh, 21, maybe 22 years old. And uh, I had been going through some things in my life uh, that scared me uh, as, a, as a man, as, a, as an individual, trying to push through. Uh, and I ended up walking into the doors of a church in Norfolk, Virginia. And I bowed my knee on that day and said, you know what, I'm, I'm done with this. And it, it took a little while, I wasn't perfect, I'm still not perfect, but I, uh, I was able to uh, overcome the things that I had done. And uh, within a couple of years, I ended up meeting my wife. Uh, we ended up getting married, we did it right. Uh, there was nothing about our dating period that anyone would ever be able to accuse. And that to me is a, a, a major um, win in my life simply because in today's day and age, no one does that anymore. And uh, that was five and a half years ago. Now we have a, a, a three-year-old and a one-year-old and, and, and God has blessed our marriage, He's blessed our home. And in spite of all of my foolishness, God told me that He had a plan. And uh, it's beginning to come to fruition. And now here I am, I sit in Greenville, North Carolina, and I pastor a church, um, and God is using my life. And if you told me that when uh, seven years ago, eight years ago, when I, when I rededicated my life, that uh, there was a hope and a future for, for God to use me, uh, I probably would have laughed at you. Uh, uh, realistically, when uh, I, I got out of the military and moved back down home, uh, it was the intention of I'm going to be in church and I'm going to do what's right, but that's about it. Like, I don't, I don't think I'm going to do much more than that. But uh, here it is. God's using me. He's building a church, a wonderful church here in Greenville. And uh, in that, uh, there are other people who, who have similar testimonies all around us. And there's a growth, there's an understanding, and there's a, a blessing of God upon our lives. Uh, individually and collectively um, and God is using us he's using this church this congregation to spread his word and so uh, I encourage you if you are looking for something real maybe you yourself grew up in church and you don't understand everything uh, or you don't know what what the plan is for your future uh, come join us uh, and 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 see that God has a plan for us maybe you have never um, been in church you say I'm not religious or, or what have you I don't I don't even know a whole lot about Jesus Christ and you know what that's fine we want you to come in and get to learn and, and get to meet people around you get to meet uh, Jesus for for yourself uh, and meet Jesus for who he is and uh, know that God has a plan he's got a purpose for you uh, we're down here every Sunday morning at 11 a.m. Uh, for service and then Sunday evening at 6 p.m. which is it's a separate service uh, and also on Wednesday nights at 7 30 we know many people have to work and they have uh, things that go on but you know what God has a plan for your life just like he did for mine and we and I, I would highly encourage you that if you want to see God move if you want to be in a place where people that can talk about what God has done come and join us in, on Sunday morning Sunday night Wednesday night and see what God can do in your life if you're willing to do like I did and surrender to Him.